Ah, it was good. We have to say a brilliant uh, thank you to David for sharing that footage with us. We do well. indeed, it but uh, it was, yeah, it was lovely. Good, glad you could say that, Al. Anyway, <laughs> it's not the only recording of the 1966 squad that has been hidden away in somebody's cupboard. Now, songwriter Bob Rag is with us. Now, Bob, it's great to see you. Thank you. Uh, now, nice you've rediscovered something quite recently. Yes, well, I did it in 1982. Because the Gordon Banks is a pal of mine. And I was yeah. in a, a boy band called the Dallas Boys. And Gordon Banks being the goalkeeper. Being yep. the goalkeeper. And Gordon said that the team are going to be doing a function near Leicester. Yeah. So I thought, get them in to sing something for the 82 team. So we got them in the studio, and in three days, I wrote the song, recorded them, videoed them, and got it released. Well, this footage has never been seen, never, and you brought no. it in for us tonight. So let's have a look at the squad in full voice. Here they are. We beat them all, we beat them all, we beat them all, Mexico, we showed the world that we're the best. We beat them all, Portugal, we beat them all, Germany, all for us and to the rest. How we love, how we cry, with the world You said that it took no time at all. You had three days. Well, that's was, all it, we had. was it hard to get the squad to perform no, as you wanted? They or were, were they brilliant? Fantastic. They all joined in. I mean, Alan Ball, I said to him, Alan, you've got a squeaky voice. Hello, Bob. <laughs> so I said, you can, sing, you can sing the top harmony. He said, What's a top harmony? So we're going to see an that. And Al Franzi did a narration at the end of it, which is absolutely. Uh -huh. Very emotional. Uh -huh. And when I dug it out and watched it, I got very emotional watching it all. Yeah. Well, the reason that nobody had ever seen it before was because of the timing with the Falklands mm. War. And That's they said right. that you didn't want to release it no, because it no. was too kind of close to yeah. the bone as far as that was concerned. Yeah. But what's the reason for putting it out there now? Well, I sat in the Isle of Man where I live, reading the newspaper, and I saw a picture of all the boys, and m most of them are gone now, and three of them had Alzheimer's. Mm -hmm. So I thought... Well, I said to my wife, I said, I'm sure we've got that video and the record. So we, we actually went in the attic and cupboards, just hit that, put it on and looked at each other and got quite cheerful over it because oh, I was there. Uh, mm. And uh, so we thought, Alzheimer's research, if they can, UK, if they can get behind this, we can get some money for the guys who suffering with it mm -hmm. and that was the main thing and it, that's the it, idea it, now. it meant a real lot to me at the yeah. time yeah. and it's out there and you can find it if you put put yeah. that into a search into, engine yeah, it'll come up it. and you'll be yes, able to yeah. do your bit and raise what you can we can if we can much as we can for good lad yeah. bob thanks ever so much so we were there is out right now yeah and if you are looking for information about dementia there are some links on our website